he is asking about shortening the prayer and very simply once you leave your hometown or the town that you're residing as in his case in Riyadh you are allowed to combine Dhuhr and Asr this is one set or Maghrib and Isha this is the second set and you may combine it forward or delaying it which means that if I'm in the way I can pray at the time of Dhuhr two rak'ahs of Dhuhr and then proceed Asr to be prayed with it afterwards after com uh, uh, concluding my prayer now or I can travel the whole noon time until it's due for Asr and then I pray two rak'ahs of Dhuhr and pray two rak'ahs of Asr at the time of Asr in your case you, you arrived at your uh, hotel it was Maghrib time and you were unable to check in and do all the paperwork until it was Isha time so this means that you are allowed to pray the three rak'ahs of Maghrib at the time of Isha and this is combining between Maghrib and Isha and delaying the first one this is no problem and then you pray two rak'ahs Isha afterwards but most likely you would pray in a, with the congregation in the masjid so you have to pray with the Imam so if the Imam prays four you pray four if the Imam shortens the prayer you pray two so in this case yes you would have uh, 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 been allowed to combine and join even if you reach your destination this was your question reaching the destination you're still labeled as a traveler the only time that the destination matters is when you go back to your hometown or to your residing uh, uh, city so in your case if you're staying in Medina for four days five days a week and then going to Mecca for five more uh, days and going to Taif or going back to Medina the whole journey you shorten and combine if you wish praying on time is the best shortening is uh, 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 the Sunnah but if you pray in a masjid or you're next to a masjid it's mandatory upon you to pray full but if you're on your own or you miss the Salah and you're praying in the masjid you pray shorten the four rakahs into two Maghrib and Fajr they are not affected the number of rakahs that is once you go back to uh, your hometown or the the city you're residing in which is Med which is Riyadh then all the excuses uh, uh, of traveling is over so the minute you enter the border of Riyadh you cannot shorten and you may only combine if you delayed the prayer to later on